Today I'm recovering five edible and medicinal mushrooms that grow in the winter time. You can actually find quite a few mushrooms in the colder months of the year. Now I live in western North Carolina, so the winters are fairly mild. So this may not apply to every region, especially those in the colder and more nor northern climates. Some mushrooms, especially winter oyster mushroom, actually prefer to fruit in colder temperatures. The mushrooms that grow mostly in the winter are usually coming off of trees like a shelf mushroom. Um, rarely do you find mushrooms growing out of the ground for obvious reasons. If it's covered in snow, it's going to be hard for the uh, mushroom to come out, especially when the ground is solid packed. Sometimes the mushrooms will be frozen too, so you might have to <laughs> get a pickaxe or an ice axe to get them off the tree. The first mushroom I'm going to cover is turkey tail. Turkey tail is a colorful, inedible, but medicinal mushroom. This mushroom is renowned for its immune boosting properties and is often found growing on the sides of trees like this birch tree. Turkey tail grow year round, but their peak freshness is in the late summer and early fall. You can still find some viable specimens into the winter time and the spring. You have to look a little harder though. Turkey tail is a thin, bendable mushroom that grows on the sides of trees. There are plenty of lookalikes, but this can be easily distinguished by the underside of turkey tail, which is white with small little pores. Turkey tail have a colorful, velvety surface which can come in a variety of different colors. You can often find turkey tail in great quantity and abundance. Lion's mane is an edible and medicinal mushroom that can be found in the summer through the early winter. Mature lion's mane have long spiny hairs that go down the surface of the mushroom. Younger specimens look like white clumps on the sides of trees. They prefer to grow on hardwoods like oak and beech, and unfortunately often grow out of reach, so you might need a ladder or to climb a tree. Lion's mane is a highly sought after medicinal mushroom that boosts cognitive function and memory, repairs neural networks in the brain, and boosts the immune system. Lion's mane is a prized culinary mushroom that has a thick, meaty texture and is comparable to crab cakes. Lion's mane is great in stir fries, on burgers, and even on pizza. Wood ear is a jiggly, ear shaped mushroom that often grows on logs, branches, and twigs. Wood ear is a very nutritious mushroom that is high in B-complex vitamins, minerals like iron and copper. It also has some medicinal properties with its polysaccharides which boost immune function. Wood ear is considered a delicacy in Asia and has been used in soups and in stir fries for ages. Amber jelly roll is one of the lookalikes of wood ear that is also edible. This mushroom has a slightly darker color than wood ear and is also slightly translucent. This fungus is more gelatinous and formless than wood ear, but is just as edible. Here we have amber jelly roll on the left and wood ear on the right. Wood ear is lighter in color and has more of a definite ear shape to it. Finally, we have winter oyster mushrooms. This is a variety of oyster mushrooms that likes to fruit at colder temperatures. This variety is thicker and meatier than the normal oysters. 
I actually prefer this version better than the summer oyster mushrooms. I often find these mushrooms growing in December on logs and branches in the forest. These mushrooms have a slight seafood taste and are highly versatile. They can be used in a wide range of dishes. So those are the five mushrooms that you can forage and cook in the winter time. In a future video, I'm going to cover wild greens that you can also find during the colder months of the year.